Hi, my name is Kwokman. I am a Republican and I live in New York. As a Christian, I know all the excuses that we use to convince people to vote Republican. I also know the fallacy of each excuse. The number one excuse that we use is that if you're pro-life, you have to vote Republican. I think we can all agree that if you have abortion, you cannot be pro-life. But do Republicans have abortion? Of course they do. If abortion statistics carry the category of party affiliation, I, I fear that the number for Republicans would not be lower than Democrats. It's not party affiliation that defines whether you're pro-life or not. It's your actions that define who you are. And in practical sense, abortion rate has been dropping since the early 80s, no matter who is in charge, Democrats or Republicans. The number two excuse that we use is the economy. They say that Republicans are good for the economy and Donald Trump is good for the economy. That is simply not true. You can simply look at what Donald Trump has been doing. He is creating a bigger deficit at a faster rate than even Obama. Obama was borrowing money to recover from a recession. What is Donald Trump's excuse? He is also threatening the federal reserve to keep the interest rate near the zero. When interest rate, when interest rate dropped to near zero some 12 years ago, it was supposed to be a stimulus to, to jumpstart the economy from a recession. If, if it's like what Donald, Donald Trump has been saying that we have the greatest economy in the history of the United States, why are we still keeping the stimulus? When we have good economy, it's time to get rid of the stimulus because when the stimulus goes on for years and even over a decade, it's become an addiction. When we have good economy, it's time to get rid of the addiction. People also say that Donald Trump is good for manufacturing jobs. That is not true either. Manufacturing investments are big and they rely on a stable economy. They simply cannot put down a lot of money to build a new factory when they don't even know when Donald Trump is going to start another trade war with China, with Mexico, or even with Canada. I mean, who does that? Who starts a trade war with Canada? Only Donald Trump would do that. He is a destructor. He has not done anything constructive during his time as president. The number three excuse that we use is immigration. They say Republicans are good for legal immigration and Democrats are good for illegal immigration. That is not true either. If you look at the, if you look at the numbers, Obama had deported more illegal aliens every year than any president before him. In fact, the first president that deported illegal aliens in large numbers was George W. Bush, and Obama outdid him. Obama also deported more illegal aliens than Donald Trump. That is before COVID-19. They say Repub Republicans are good for legal immigration. That is not true either. Donald Trump has slashed legal immigration by more than 50%, and that was also before COVID-19. So this year, I'm going to vote for Joe Biden and Harris, and I'm going to vote for Democrats in every ticket down the ballot. And I hope that you would join me in removing all the Republicans from office and take back our party and start rebuilding as soon as possible. Thank you for listening.